about going to college. What's the best advice you received or got from someone? And what's the best advice you would give to a student going to college now? Mm. Yeah, I don't know if I have the best advice, honestly. And I don't know if, yeah, if this is the best advice, but I'm just going to say like what came to my mind. So first of all, don't take out loans. <laughs> And it's particularly and especially don't take out private loans. If you can't afford it, go somewhere else because it's just not worth it. There are cheaper colleges. You know, you can do community college or whatever you need to do to get to where you want to be without taking out debt. It feels impossible or whatever, but it's not impossible. People do it all the time. And uh, yeah, I can say a lot about that, but just avoid it. Um, the Bible says, if you want a biblical reference, the Bible says that the borrower is slave to the, to the lender. You don't want to be a slave. And I feel that weight every day, even though I'm able to pay off my loans. So I'm not in default or anything, but it's still just such a burden. And it's a lot of the loan companies are really predatory and it's just, it's just a whole thing. Anyway, so don't take out loans. <laughs> also don't it, this is easier said than done because there's a lot of like scholarships and things associated with going to school right away like incentives and so there's this real pressure to go to college right after high school but I kind of hate that because people most kids don't know what they want to do at 18 years old and I don't think it has to be that way I think you can take time to think about it I think you can go to community college like I said or just you know take some classes at a really cheap price just you know, continue to move forward, continue to progress, but you don't have to go to like a really expensive school, live on campus, da, 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 da. like just focus on what matters most, you know, which is not necessarily like higher education. I think that's something that was ingrained into a lot of like immigrant, uh, like first generation Americans, you know, education is like the most important thing, but I would actually beg to differ, you know, I would say your relationship with God and being led by the Holy Spirit is the most important thing. I would say education is really important. Education can be a way out of poverty and all. And like I said, you can educate yourself, but education doesn't always look like a four-year college, a private college, or whatever. You know, this education can look a lot of different ways. You can do a certification, you can do a gap year, and you're still learning during that gap year, doing some like you know, an AmeriCorps program or whatever. You can travel, you can, um, you know, get certified to teach English and go abroad. I don't know, there's different things you can do. Um, it's too long of an answer, but basically I would advise don't take out loans and don't rush to go to school because it's really expensive and half the time you don't even know what you want to do. So be really, you know, thoughtful in your approach to college, no matter what people say, because I know for some people it feels like that's your only option when you get out of high school, but I promise there are other ways to succeed and you can um, go to school later. <laughs>